What's up guys, Huto7 here and today I've got a video to show you how to get your saved games from your Xbox 360 over to your Xbox One using backwards compatible. So there's a lot of games that are coming out on the backwards compatible, the list is getting larger and larger and a lot of really awesome games are coming out. There's Red Dead Redemption, there's Halo Reach, Gears of War, uh, Call of Duty Black Ops, so a lot of like more major games are coming out. And uh, you know if you're an Xbox Live Gold member you get those two free backwards compatible games uh, every month. So if you've got some games and you want to get your saved games, I'm going to show you how you can do that. Uh, the first thing you need to do is uh, get out your Xbox 360. Hopefully you still got that lying around and it works and everything. You need to dust that off and boot it up and you need to make sure that it's connected to the internet. And uh, when you uh, have got it connected to the internet, what you're going to want to do is go over to your system settings here. And in system settings, go to storage. And now you'll have a couple options here. Uh, you'll have your hard drive, and you'll also have this uh, selection, which is the cloud saved games. Now, this is what's going to be important because what we're going to do is save our files into the cloud, and that's going to let us access them on the Xbox One. So uh, we're going to go to our hard drive first, and we're going to navigate to our games and apps. Now, this is a list. You can see all the various games that I've played, and I've got my uh, save data here on them. So one of the games here, Assassin's Creed 2, is backwards compatible. So if I want to play this on the Xbox One, uh, and I want to keep my save game. What I need to do is find my saved game data, and it will say it right there. It says saved game data. I've got two here because I've, you know, I've got two different saved games. But what I want to do is uh, copy one of these. So I'm going to select it, and I'm going to choose copy right here. And it's going to ask me for my location, and I'm going to copy it to the cloud save games. Uh, it should take just a second because they're small files. And now that it's copied there, if I go back, it will show that it's in sync, and you can see that now this file is available to access from my Xbox One. Okay, so we'll back out now here, and we'll go to Cloud Save Games, and there you see Assassin's Creed 2. So these are the other save games I've copied. I've got, you know, Lego Star Wars, I've got Mass Effect, N+, Perfect Dark, and Red Dead Redemption. So these are all save games that I have on my 360 that I copied over to the Xbox One. So there you have it. A quick uh, question that I know I'll get because I've been asked this before uh, is can you use an external, uh, you know, storage device, um, like a flash drive or an external hard drive? And uh, it's a little bit tricky. The the answer is um, not really. And the reason why is because the Xbox One and the Xbox 360 have different requirements in terms of storage capacity, and they also format the hard drives a little bit different. So they don't really play nice. Technically, it is possible, and maybe I'll make a video about how to do that. But for now, the easiest way by far is just to copy your save games into that cloud uh, save game file and uh, storage space, and that will let you access them on the Xbox One. Thanks so much for watching, guys. I'm going to have a couple of videos uh, to show off uh, some guides about how to get on the backwards compatible and uh, play your Xbox 360 games. So be sure to leave a like if you uh, enjoyed the video or if you learned something and uh, subscribe to stay tuned to all of my videos that are going to be coming out about backwards compatible on the Xbox One. Thanks so much for watching.